Hey, it's been a while. Welcome back. Let's catch up. My name's Ian, and here's what I've been up to for the last couple of years. When we left off, Destiny 2 had just launched their big alpha event. They had invited a bunch of streamers up, and of course, I couldn't make it because my appendix had just burst. Also, I wasn't invited. But I did make a video about it. I just never uploaded it due to the heavy medication I was on during filming. In hindsight, it is pretty funny, so I might end up uploading it anyway. Who knows? Anyway, after that, I thought, I've always wanted to learn how to bartend. My aunt and uncle have a restaurant up in Virginia. I got a job there as a bartender, and I got to learn bartending from some of the most brilliant bartenders I've ever had the pleasure of working with. After about four months of bartending, I came back down to Georgia. I took some acting classes. I took Meisner. I took improv class, and I started bartending down here. I bounced from bar to bar, and after a while I started looking into other jobs. I started doing some prop work, I did some freelance work, I worked as an aquarium technician. I've picked up a few hobbies like coding in Python from my local Pokemon Go Discord server, attempting to speak French through the app Duolingo, and I met a guy who is the foremost expert on medieval weaponry, British medieval weaponry, and he's teaching me how to sword fight. I even have my own wooden practice sword, so that's pretty cool. I had some eye surgery done, which I never thought I would do. I was in a couple short films, and I booked a commercial that you've probably seen by now. But the story of how I booked it is so much more interesting. So I get this audition for the role of teammate. I'm supposed to celebrate at the end of, I suppose, a gaming tournament with the lead, who is a gamer. I'm reading through my sides, and I get to the point where they have the sides for the lead, and I think, hmm, let me go ahead and just read these. They want the lead to be able to do these finger exercises. These finger exercises are for people who have arthritis, people who game a lot, or people who type for a living. I played a lot of Halo 3 back in the day, so I am actually quite familiar with these finger exercises. I used to do them. So I go an hour early to this audition, and they are looking for the part of the lead. I'm still supposed to be teammate. They call me in, they say, what role are you? I tell them I'm teammate, and they say, listen, we actually want more people to audition for the lead. We haven't found our lead yet. Why don't you go ahead and show us what you can do? Do you know what you're supposed to do? And of course, since I've read the sides, I knew what I was supposed to do. I did the finger exercises for them. I did a few other things that they asked me to do, and they called me back a couple days later and said, you got the call back. Come meet us here, and we'll see if you're right for the part. So I'm on my way there, day of. I'm gonna be an hour early, of course. I get a call from my agent. She says, Ian, make sure to be there an hour before your call time. They are running way ahead of schedule. And I say, no problem, I'm already on my way. I'm gonna be there exactly an hour at a time. I get there, I'm the only one there. It's six people I've never seen before. The director, some producers, a few other people who I assume are very important. And they asked me to do what I did in the audition. They say they liked my intensity and they liked my ability to do this. They say you rise to the occasion, but in actuality, you default to the level of your training. I must have done well on the callback because I booked it and they had me on set for the role of gamer in a Holiday Inn Express commercial. Yeah, that happened. You know, I guess it pays to be prepared. All of this leads into what I'm doing this next month, which is moving. I will no longer be in Georgia. I will be living in California, hopefully in less than a month's time. We'll see. I already have an area picked out and I should have a job lined up. I know who I'm moving in with. That's gonna be a fun road trip since Aaron and I will be driving there. I'm gonna try and record as much as I can because of course I wanna share that road trip with you guys. It's gonna hopefully be pretty exciting. Oh, and I am streaming Bloodborne tonight. I've already streamed two hours of it on Twitch, just me playing through Yarnum, getting to Cathedral Ward. The goal is for myself and my buddy Scott to get to the DLC, which I've never played before. So I'm really excited about getting to play some new content for a game that I enjoyed so much. Join me at 10.30 p.m. or catch me on the next YouTube video. Either way, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.